This morning, Volkswagen and its Audi subsidiary are pulling many of its diesels out of showrooms. The company's CEO is apologizing after the EPA found the automaker cheated on emissions tests for diesel cars built since 2009. Volkswagen shares took a nosedive this morning at Germany's main stock exchange. Chris Van Cleve is outside a VW dealership in Manhattan. Chris, good morning. Good morning. Volkswagen and Audi dealers like the one behind me here across the country are being told to stop selling certain diesel versions of five popular vehicles after this EPA notice of violation. It is a big black eye for one of the world's biggest automakers. The EPA alleges Volkswagen cheated emissions testing by designing what was called a defeat device. It's a switch built into some four-cylinder diesel models from years 2009 to 2015 that essentially game the system. It would detect when the car was undergoing emissions tests and switch it to a more efficient mode so the car would pass the test. The automaker's CEO is now apologizing in a statement saying, I personally am deeply sorry that we have broken the trust of our customers and the public. We do not and will not tolerate violations of any kind of our internal rules or of the law. The allegations cover roughly 482,000 vehicles in the United States. The EPA can issue a fine of up to $37,500 per vehicle. That works out to roughly $18 billion in potential fines. A big story this morning, Chris. Thank you so much.